If necessary, the SBE 320 and SBX 350 contacts can be removed from their housings. This can be accomplished by using the extraction tool 970P1 or a flathead screwdriver. To use the extraction tool 970P1, slide the wires to the outside of the connector, orient the extraction tool so it is perpendicular to the spring with the notch facing up. Insert the extraction tool between the connector wall and the, and the contacts until it stops. Depress the spring by pushing down on the extraction tool handle. With the spring depressed, pull the cable to release the contacts. If an extraction tool 970P1 is not available, a flathead screwdriver can be used. Please select one that is 3 16th of an inch or 4.75 millimeters or smaller. Orient the screwdriver blade so it is perpendicular to the spring. Insert the screwdriver 1 inch to 1 and a quarter inch, which is 25 millimeters to 32 millimeters. The screwdriver should be inserted between the connector wall and the contact. Depress the spring by pulling the handle using the keying feature. With the spring depressed, pull the cable from the housing. If auxiliary contacts are used, remove the retaining pin by using a 0 0.06 inch or 1.5 millimeter pin. To start, tap the pin with a hammer, then finish the removal process with a pair of pliers. Next, pull the auxiliary contact housing from the connector, place the tip of the extraction tool between the spring and the contact, depressing the spring. At the same time, pull the wires to remove the contacts.